Today we're going to show you how to get started and use your new Whisper ultrasonic leak detector. Inside you'll find a rubber extension probe, two D-cell batteries, headphones, and your new Whisper. If you purchase the Whisper with an accessory kit, you'll also find a metal contact probe, rubber extension, two D-cell batteries, a whisper transmitter, and a premium set of headphones. To install the batteries, first press the tab on the battery cover and remove the cover. Install the two D-cell batteries and replace the cover. Once the batteries are installed, long press the power button to turn whisper on. Whisper is now ready to operate. To detect a leak, slowly sweep across the suspected leak area. Whisper will alarm when a leak is detected. Swipe up or down on the touchpad to adjust sensitivity. We recommend using the supplied headphones for finding leaks. Using the headphones lets you hear the leaks by amplifying the sound to an audible level. To enable or disable the laser, quickly press the power button. The rubber extension probe reduces the spread of the whisper's detection range. This can help locate leaks in environments with background noises. Screw the metal contact probe into the tip of the whisper to check mechanical parts such as worn bearings. When the batteries are low, the power indicator will begin to flash. When the batteries are critically low, the power and highest signal indicators will flash alternately. Depending on whether the laser is in use, Whisper has an excellent battery life and will generally operate between 115 and 165 hours.